We have a double master's box here. Had this for a couple of days now, finally got a chance to record. We are going to open up this box and play sealed with it. However, unlike a normal sealed game, we're gonna do 12 packs each. Basically split the box in half. All right, we'll get to it. Right. There's our lovely box toggles. We will get to them later. So you get two of them, don't you? Two of them. Yeah, where the cards go. Is it two of them in there? There's two of them in there, yep. Alright, so... So, let's get this box out of here. Alright. Let's hope some good pulls. Alright, that's a good start with a filter land. Guys of St. Trap, one of the worst myth one of the worst mythics in this set. Yep, yep, the Pete Gang Stinkers also got adapted to Automaton, so that pack is worth like a dollar. Yeah. Like I reckon we'll get unlucky. <laughs> I never get lucky. Oh, we got the Hydra. And and what's that? This is a couple of dollars. Mmm, another stinker. Voice of Resurgence <laughs> is okay, and Liege of the Tangle. Oof. Kind of expecting a little. Another filter land. All right, and a toxic deluge. There you go. That's uh, that's a nice pack. There's a trash for treasure Ooh, and a foil. foil. Remember the form. Foil ever flowing callus. Vexing Shusha and massa transmuter. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you're you're picking the real bad ones so far. Yeah, look, the commons <laughs> and uncommons might be decent, but yeah, I have to be. I'm looking at this going. Mm. Oh, hello, Abyssin. Mm. Merciless execution. One thing I should mention, whoever pulls the most expensive card is going to win the dice roll for our seal games. So currently I'm leading that. <laughs> yeah, and you're continuing to. Uh, I got Hannah, oh, no. Ship's Navigator, and Pure Steel Paladin, which is, that's a mm, card. Mm, that's a card. And two more foil commons, you know, for Porter. Vish Cow, and a Thunderous Closet. An Awakening Zone, and a Greater Good. Greater Good's not bad. Greater Good's not bad. Oh! Okay. Pro Mox. All right. And a Sharoon. Oh, that's very good. Right, I'm going to say it here. I think you somehow... <laughs> I think I got the good side of the box. So far. There's a card. Academy Ruins. Oh, uh, yeah. Yep. That's a good card. Salvage Titan is not a good card. I mark it. <laughs> I mean, you can at least use it somewhere. Oh, Oubliette. Foil Oubliette. Ooh, Ooh, no, that's something decent. And a Death Shadow, which would have been relevant a couple years ago. Wound Refraction. Camera is on, not bad. I also got Tuck Tuck. Ooh. <laughs> These are stinkers, man. <laughs> Your side of the table is just not going. I don't know much of like, have you got any Mythics over there yet? No. Wow. Jeez, my side of the box is the only side. Oh, these are okay. Actually, that's quite good. Send triplets. And Scarab God. Oh, Khan Liberators here. Oh. Oh, yes. All right, well, you're going first. <laughs> I mean, the Chrome Mox sort of blocked that in already, but... Um, Friction Metamorph, which is okay. Yeah. And a Water uh, Bastion. Got a Rolling Earthquake. Right, two boosters left. Two boosters left. What do we got? Okay, meddling mage, so Ooh. you know, Chris Pacool. And Snaring Bridge. That's an example. Yeah, like, I feel like we got very different quality packs. <laughs> um, Bosch. For sure. And some foils. Alright, final pack. Final pack. Alright, let's see what we get. I think these games are going to go very quick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I know, you, I know your, your deck's full of bombs, so I might means I might change how I build my deck. And this pack did not improve matters. Uh, oil Uncommon Sandstone Oracle, Oil Metallic Rebuke Common, mm -hmm. Doom mm -hmm. Necromancer, and Mana Reflection. Alright, we had a Fulminata Mage, a Blade Slicer, and two foils that don't matter. Yeah, alright. Ooh, Foil Bowman is better. Actually, I need one of those, so that's good. Yeah. Alright, so... <laughs> that was a bunch of cards. That was a bunch of cards. Were they good right. cards? <laughs> Let's get to some deck. I, I mean, I think it's pretty clear. Well, that what do we do I'm... with the, the box topper? 
So I reckon whoever wins our still game can be the one that opens it. Okay, so we're not. We're not yeah. I thought there's two in there, aren't there? There are, but. Oh, you don't want to open it in like. No, brain. no. No, okay. <laughs> you don't want to live Let's not life. play with the box stuff. Magic cards have been played with. <laughs> um, I think it's pretty clear that I've, I've won the most expensive yeah. card pools. Yeah. Alright. I so. don't think that's particularly in dispute. <laughs> so, how many mythics do we actually end up with? How many you got uh, over there? Two. Pretty sure. Two. I definitely have more than that. Got, um, yeah, just two. Snare yeah, Bridge. Chrome Mox. Okay. Tiger oh, Amazon, of course. So, I had five. So, I have a seven mythic box. What I've read, that's about standard. I mean, this is the not, games will be fun. The this game's is not gonna... too bad. Like, I've yeah, seen but, Chrome but Mox. considering the the dice roll, <laughs> considering the <laughs> the cost of getting the privilege to roll, I yeah, want more. true. <laughs> when the buy-in's this high, I want a lot more. Mm -hmm. All right, um, we will do some cuts and some time lapse here while we build because this is gonna well, half a box each is gonna take a while to build. So, yeah. see you. I'm making a deck that so far I've only got two rares in, and they're not even good in the deck. Well, because I can't beat, all these I can't, rares. <laughs> well, no, but I can't beat you trying to do something unfair. So I have to just play low to the ground, fair magic, and mm -hmm. I'm like, all right, that's actually not very exciting. What can I do with this? Oh, right, I think I'm playing green. Yeah. Because I've got several ancient stirrings. To find Khan, cool. No, the, yeah, the fine. Oh, the fine Khan and Tron and such. Watch as I don't have one of the pieces of um, Urza. Oh, that would be funny. That would be really funny. Very clearly, you had an artifact matters thing with the set. Oh, that the whole it's like artifact masters, really. Yeah. Um, I wish I just. <laughs> Yeah, instead of going for the double theme. The double theme that's like, but why though? You have a Myers Embrace. I've never seen that card. Oh, yeah, it's, it's an old, it used to be a bomb in oh. limited for memory. I don't remember if it did something standard in my life. I just remember that card. I remember that card. It was before my time, though. Mm. Yes. Oh, good. I did get all three pieces of Urza. Just. <laughs> Deck is so bad. <laughs> well, I, I I just cannot play the long game. I have to go like yeah, ridiculously go hard aggro, and fast. Yeah. And didn't I'm gonna check what my red is like after this? But like right now I'm looking at like black blue artifact aggro, and it's like yep, but this is all commons. <laughs> color gonna be is the next question. Okay, do I need another color dog? It's very green. Ah, uh, the smiths are when you cast. That makes some of the things I was doing much worse. And a deck that already wasn't great. Cool. Yeah, a lot of my... But I have all these Dark Steel Citadels. I'm like, oh, well, I have all these cards that want to land in artifact entries. I'm like, I should check. I'm like, nope, it's a cast trigger. I'm like, cool, these Dark Steel Citadels are not actually doing much in this deck. I have a bunch of trash to treasures. I could do a trash to treasure deck, but then it's like, yeah. it's like I'm trash to treasuring out Bosch, which you then exile. <laughs> like, like what I put out, what I can trash to treasure in, or like send triplets, which would be funny. I could steal your palm, but it's also like, all right, so then I'm five color or four color trash to treasure and I'll give you restorations. That doesn't seem. I hope you're ready for a wall of two drops. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> this deck is over half two drops. I'm gonna just beat the crap out of you in the face really early on and hope that works. Welcome back to uh, our sealed games now. 
So I've put together over here, basically Tron. I've got the Urza Lands, I've got Ancient Stirrings, Expedition Maps, Ramp and Khan to ramp into. I'm basically all in on Khan. Resolve Khan and use him to win the game. So I don't have a lot of creatures. Most of the ones I do have are going to be chump blocking so that I'm not murdered. Um, and running the Ensnaring Bridge. Since Chrome Mox, Ensnaring Bridge and Khan are all worth quite a bit of money, they'll be proxied in the deck and so they'll stay in these hard sleeves when they're out on the field. I think that's pretty much it. I've gone with blue, uh, sorry, green and white, mainly for the green so I could find the Tron pieces and white so I had some removal because my green pool was quite terrible. Um, yeah, I think that covers it pretty well. I'm going to try and con James out. So you had good cards. Uh, I had a good card. I have, I have Scarab God. And after that, I went with a bunch of draft chat. I'm running draft bad star, not good anywhere. I'm bully, two of it, because it's quite a menace to deal with the Khan and the ancient stirring situation I heard. I'm running relic runners, glaze fiends. I do have a cranial plating. Um, I also run executions capsule. I'm basically running blue, black, hit you in the face a lot of artifacts. I do have academy ruins and I have a mistress factory. So I have, I just have to hope my literal actual pike, well not literal actual, my pikers, my two ones, my so many two mana two ones actually get there before Khan shows up. And if they don't, then I have to hope Scarab God somehow gets me out of the dirt really, really quickly. <laughs> I mean, he's hard to get rid of, so. Yeah, I have Brixing Revoke as well, so I can just name Khan Liberated. So mm -hmm. yeah, there are lines. All right, fingers crossed. <laughs> I'm uh, I'm getting running some fabricate to try and stop James from hitting me. So <laughs> we'll see how this works. So let's get to the game. Just a note from me while editing: there are a few minor mistakes made during these games that I feel I should point out. I cast Revoke Existence at instant speed both times I played it. It's actually a sorcery, and at one point I return an artifact from my graveyard with Mirror Retriever, except as it entered the battlefield instead of when it died. None of these mistakes affected the results of the games. However, it's worth pointing out in case you're wondering what's going on. Now, let's get on to the games. Let's draw our seven. Yep. I open the most value from the packs, so I will be going first in yep. this game. Planes go. Central. Island. Flare husk go. It's a one one. Oh, we don't have Ooh, exciting. Well, it's a one one. Watch out. Yep. I guess I don't like this. You don't get to see the gross turn on enough. Alright. Go, watch out, I'm gonna beat you down with the <laughs> wandering ones. Forest up. Um, and I will ancient stirrings. Yep. Top five. Yep. Here it goes. Which of these colourless cards do I want to keep? Funny enough, they're all colourless! What? No, never. Um. Oh, it's my friend freaking his deck. <laughs> I'm going to keep this card. Let's go bottom of the weapon. Pass the turn. Untap, crawl. Uh, swamp, A2. Mm -hmm. Play a Glaze Fiend. Swing at you for one. I'll take one. Yep. Go. Untap, draw. Play a Planes. I will tap two. Play an Eager Conscript. You've got to square one. Yeah, square one. Uh, both, yeah, both get square one. Uh, yeah, I'll keep that on top. I will also keep that on top. Mm, exciting and terrifying. And then I will tap one and play an action stirrings. Alright, cool. You didn't play any troll lands, I noticed. I will keep this Urza's Tower. Yeah, you know, I'm just going to say here, yeah, if you don't start curving out the Urza lands, they're much less impressive here. <laughs> because you'll play all three of them and be at six mana rather than seven. Yep, alright, yep. let's go. On tap. Let's... Island, uh, ex Executioner's Capsule, which mm -hmm. gives this plus two plus two to under turn. Then paying, paying two for a Mer Retriever, giving this plus two plus two to under turn. Swinging at you in the air with a four or five to under turn. I'll take four. Yeah. Sounds good. All right, your turn. Your turn. Your turn. I will play out this as a spell. I'm going to tap two. 
Um, and we're going to exile that. Okay. That's fair. It's exile forever. Last turn. Okay. On tap. I have to beat you different ones. It's Misha's factory for the turn. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Not worth killing that. <laughs> <laughs> Go! My 1 1 aggro attack plan is failing. I will play this as mine. Mm hmm. If you get two more lands of any kind, you can play Khan. No, no, right. And I will tap 1, 2, 3, 4, and play out this Iron Steed. I have a response. Yep. I'm going to pay one and cast Steel Sabotage to counter target artifact. That works. None of that. Only one 2 2 blocker, please. Pass the turn. <laughs> end of your turn. Yeah, end of your turn. Execution's capsule. Destroy the. Yeah, I was just like, actually, that might just be correct here. Uh, untap. Draw. I'll untap the turn. Swing at you for two. I take two. Cool. Second main. Play. Oh, how much do you give up? One white. Yeah, one white up. Hmm. I may have a path to exile. I mean, I still make you have it. Five, Scarab God. Ooh! Yep. It ended my turn. I have path to exile. Yep. Cool. <laughs> I have to check. <laughs> swamp. Does that stop his return? Oh, uh, well, yeah, he's exiled now. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to yep. check if it was a dice trigger or a leaves trigger. Yep. Okay. I'll untap. And draw. So I will tap one, two, three, four. Yep. To play a overflowing chalice two. Then I will tap three mm-hmm. and play at an ensnaring bridge. Right. I have one card in hands. Yep. Ensnaring so bridge power or uh, with power greater, so you can hit me with your one one still. Great. And I pass the turn. I'm gonna know the card. Steel sabotage is my way to answer that. And I've already used it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm actually I think I'm just actually dead, but we'll have to play it out. Mm-hmm. Uh Island, A2, Eager Constructs, we both get to scribe one. Yep. Bottom that. You have one card in hand, right? And you know it's card. Mm. Hit you for two, cry to myself. I take two and go to eleven. I resign myself to what's going. Your turn. Right, untap. Draw. Um, ancient stirrings. You have Tron, don't you? I want to see if I can get Tron. Come on, I want to get Tron into Khan. You can just play Khan! I know, but then it's better if I get to Tron into Khan. Fortunately, I did not hit Tron. Good! You deserve to get rolled by that. <laughs> um, so... I only have six minutes so I need to take one of the lands. I will take this Buried Ruin and put that into my hand. Um, I will then play Buried Ruin, tap, oops, that's the top turn. Yep. Tap seven to play Calm the Road. Alright, what do you want to exile? So I got no hand. Um, I'm going to choose Target Player, exhaust their hand, just to give them some life. Yeah, make them ten loyalty. Yeah. Shockingly, I think I'm about to lose. <laughs> cool, my turn. Your turn. I have no cards in hand. It means I can't attack. It means I draw. Your turn. <laughs> Alright. Draw. Please don't ult Khan. No, I'm not going to ult Khan. <laughs> as funny as that would be, no, I'm not going to ult Khan. So Khan will now tick down to 7. Yep. Um, to blow up. That. Right, take And I will pass it. Go. Oh. Roll. Uh, pay two. Play Relic Runner. Um, it's She's a 2 1. She can't be blocked if I cast a historic spell this turn. Right. Uh, uh, before you go to combat, since you can swing right now, yep. um, I'm going to give you a 1 1 and exile, exile that one. Uh, do we have a one token? We should have one. Right. We'll just say that's your right. thing, because I don't think we have our change. That's okay. Alright. 
that's so now it's your turn because I cannot attack. All right. So for the video, um, since I have a lock at this point but no way to actually win, you're going to see this in time lapse as Khan slowly destroys James both mentally and physically. Yay! Give <laughs> pair of lightning grooves. Tip Khan up. Yep, it's an island. Freaks in Metamorph, making a copy of Eager Contracts. We both scry one. Keep it a foundry. Yep. Play it, Lightning Grooves. Destroy yep. Eager Construct. Yep. Go. Land cycle to go get a. Yep. Forest. Play Forest. Tick Khan up. Begs all your hand. Yep. It is a Metallic Rebuke. Painsmith, go. Exile, Painsmith. Relic Runner, go. Hey, I've assembled Tron! I'm actually have... going away, how do you win? <laughs> I have creatures, I just haven't drawn them. <laughs> yeah, but I'm playing creatures as quickly as you're destroying them. I know, them. that's Can't. I will now blow up. Uh... So i got to play a crop rotation, sack that land, I'll find. Khan's gonna nuke. Uh, that. Oh, the Mana Wolf. Get rid of the Mana Wolf. Oh. Uh, Academy Ruins? Oh, yeah. Uh, Khan will have to. Oh, he has to tick up. So he goes to seven. Yeah, I'm versing a modern deck, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Khan will tick down, blow up the. Uh, the one one? The one one, yeah. Play a Mur Retriever. Short tap two, play an Iron Steed. Salvage Titan? Pay two, sack my Buried Ruin, get another artifact back. Eagle Construct. Yep, we'll get Scroll on. Khan will minus. Yep. Blow that up. Yep. Uh, actually, no, blow up the Academy okay, Ruins. Play another Ironwood Steed. Yep. I'll make another Servo. Um, well, my artifacts are really big right now. I just need to get your stuff out of the way. Oh my me. god, stop playing creatures. I have like 16 2 mana <laughs> 2 ones. That's all this deck is, is 2 mana 2 ones that are kind of bad. Khan will have to tick up this turn. Mm, you nuke my non-existent hand. Yep. Khan and his shitty, shitty robots. Um, I will play a Blade Slicer. Exile the 6-4. After it isn't, but okay. So I'll put a 7. We do not have a 14-sided <laughs> flex on here. That's, that's worth 7 because it's foil. Go! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Fairy Mechanist. Now Fairy Mechanist is a field. I look at the top three. I can brew an artifact among them, put it into my hand, put the rest on the bottom. I'm going to put this in my hand, put these on the bottom. I'm going to reveal Glaze Fiend and play Glaze Fiend. Exile your hand. You might actually be in trouble. Oh. And you're playing? I can attach this to instant speed. Ah, oh, yeah. So, okay. combat fate. Uh, so this, oh, no, damn, the trigger triggers. Because I could attach this to instant speed. I was going to have zero power. And I'd be oh, able to attack. Right, yeah, and I'd be able to go, it gets bigger, yeah. Yeah, but I can't because it entering <laughs> triggers. Makes him too big, yeah. Because I don't get in the hit. And it doesn't matter because Khan's just going to nuke it. Right, nothing I do matters. Khan just nukes anything I find that answers the situation. <laughs> right. Cool. Sorry, I thought I had hope for a second. <laughs> So Khan is going to blow up in Snaring Bridge. Yep. And then we're going to swing out because Matt is, that lethal? is for blockers. I have no idea. Yep. Right. Love it. Love it. Love so it. I am swinging at you for twenty-five. Twenty-five. Yeah. Do we hit twenty-six? We don't. It's twenty-five. 
cool. Most Shit. of them on the ground, they're blockable. Yeah, cool, great, love it. Mm. Uh, I guess to declare attacks, I'm going to make Mishra's Factory a creature. Mm -hmm. Does that seem as important here? It, yeah, yeah, back if you like. Yeah, well, it's going to block the um, Chief of the Foundry, and then. Mm -hmm. So that one will tap to. Not yet, sorry. It it's will... a 2 3 just so you know. Yeah, I know, because this can tap itself. This inbox is a free free. Oh, okay. I thought you can't give it first strike, otherwise, this will be a very different calculation. Actually, wait, is that a goal? No, no it's a construct. Construct. Cool. Oh, good, yeah, most of your stuff's constructs. The goal thing only helps the goal. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to block. What goal thing? This. Let's just give it golem first strike. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, that, that's why it's first strike. Go golem oh, creatures okay. control. It's part of the golem tribal deck. Um, you've never played Golem Tribal? No, I've never played Golem Tribal. You're not missing out, it's pretty bad. Um, player has to block the Golem. That's funny though, I'm gonna be able to kill Chief Founder and actually do some pretty good trade blocks here. Yep. Um, lock one of the Iron League seeds for 2 1. This is blocking this, just so yep. you can see. Then I will be taking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So what are those two blocking? Nothing. Okay, I'm trying to work out I can afford not okay. to block them. Um, screw it. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll take 15, go to 5. Alright, so, so that dies. This taps. So. Mission Factory taps to give itself plus one plus one. Yep. It's now free free. This will die. This will die. This dies from first strike. Yep. Uh, this will die, but that'll have two damage on it. So once the assembly worker is gone, it will, it will also, also die. die. Then I take 15 to the face. Ow. Khan is unprotected. Yep, that's that's the moral victory I'm going for here. And I will pass the turn. I know those people are going, you made a million misplays. I did, because I could have attached this at instant speed. Did I? No. I mean, would have saved one creature. Girl. That's not what I needed. Damn it, that cube's really not what I needed. One, two. So what I was hoping to get was Flare Husk on this. Makes it a uh, one, two flyer. Mm -hmm. Pay one to attach cranial plating to it. Makes it a one, two, three, four. A um, yeah, creature again. Uh, makes it a five something, and then I was just hoping I'd know that I'd cheat. <laughs> um, from Hell's Heart, I is that enough to kill? Yeah, that's enough to kill Khan. Yeah. I kill Khan. Khan will die. You have defeated Khan. So you may concede now, <laughs> if you wish. Um, your turn. All right. Untap all my creatures. Yep. Go for turn. Swim with all my creatures. Yep, In fact, right. put all lightning greaves on uh, the golem. Let's go to game two. I'm dead. Yeah, super dead. Right. Um, yes, I'm going to go first with an island. Go. We will go forest, and then I will play a. Chrome Mox. Okay, what are um, you imprinting? And I will put a Blade Splicer underneath it. Is that a Splicer? I thought it was a land. Not land permanent. Oh. You're, you're thinking of Mox Diamond. Ah, right. Yep. I will then tap two. Uh -huh. And play an Overturn Chalice. One. Pass the turn. Really? We're playing a different game. <laughs> <laughs> Just gonna put it out here. Uh, island? I'm gonna pay two and play an eager construct, so we may both scry one. So my two mana two two will let us both scry one, which is very comparable <laughs> to what your turn just was. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna bomb that. No, I'm gonna keep that on top. What's what's the point not to? All right, your turn. Oh, what's happening? I'm sorry, none of those lands are from lands. I'll play an Urza's Mine. Four mana, turn two. Uh, tap two. Play E construct. Construct. Okay, we both get the card on. Got the same one from before. And pass turn. Okay. Drop. Want to trade constructs? Not really. I'm gonna play. Actually, considering how you 
We'll go lug up a bowl, maybe. <laughs> Swamp. Gonna pay one and two. Play a Mer Retriever. Go. Right. We'll tap one to cycle this Ash Bear. I get their planes. Put them in the library. Planes. I will then play. Set planes for turn. I'll pass them. We'll do. One tap. Cool. Uh, Academy Ruins? This is, this is what I'm doing, okay. Pay three. Uh, Iron Bully. <laughs> yep, this, this is the world we live in. I need a counter. Putting a plus one plus one counter on my EU construct. Oh, it's a free free now. Yep, so swing at you with this free free. Okay. Um, I'm gonna exile your EU construct. Sure. Yep, that's fine by me. Yeah. Okay, your turn. Let's pass the turn. Okay. Untap. Oh. Uh, island. One, two, and three. Frixie Minimal has a copy of Iron Bully. Ooh, alright. Putting a more encounter on the other Iron Bully. Is that a 2 2 with Menace? 2 2 with Menace, yep. All watch right. out. Uh, swing at you with a. Yeah, 2 2 with Menace. Yep, I'll take two. Can't block that. No, you can't. Mm -hmm. uh, your turn. Alright. I'm not going to have anything. I'm gonna kill you the Iron Bullies. I'll play an Urza's Power Plant. I'll then tap 7 for the only 7 drop in my deck. Karma and response. Alright, you got the Karma response? Pay 1, 2, tap one of my artifacts for its uh, improvised cost. Pay 3 more mana. I'm pay 3 more mana. Nope. Mana's dead. Did not clear my hand first. <laughs> Did not clear the field. <laughs> Alright, hope you got a backup plan. <laughs> yeah, I do. Artifacts. <laughs> Over you. Alright, untap. Swing at you with this one one of menace. Swing at you with this iron bully. I can't block either of them, so no. take three. Take three. Second main. Go to I'm gonna play a relic runner. Um pass the turn. They all joked about the iron bullies. I'll play this as mine. Last time. Swing at you yet again with uh, the 1-1 one, one of Menace and the 2-2 two, two of Menace. I take another 3 and go to 12. Iron Bullies! Ah, stop bullying me. <laughs> Riddle Smith. They empower each other of their bullying. Go. Mm. Okay. You will know. The answer to... <laughs> no, it's not going there. Tap. 4. Play at Draw is familiar. Yep. Go. Roll. Land, pay three. Iron Bully number three. Oh my god. Yep. Another counter on my Iron Bully here. These ones are both this. Swing at you with the. Also, I don't want to. No, that's fine. I'll keep the misplay. This can't be blocked this turn because I played a historic spell. So I'll swing at you for two with this. I'll swing at this free free with Menace. And the 1-1 one, one with Menace. Oh. Cool, go. Um, so I will take 6 yeah. damage. Yeah, unless you want to double block one. Alright, we'll double block the 1-1 one, one with Menace. Oh. So it'll, 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 it'll die? Yep. Yeah. I will take... 5. 5. I go to 7. Um, yep, just to save time then. Can the Academy Ruins and Freaks Minimal back on top of my deck to be another Iron Bully next turn. Yep. Your turn. Right. Iron Bully Trial, mate. <laughs> that does not get me there. I was kidding about the Iron, Gold, the iron Bully's doing it. <laughs> uh, I will tap to play my Retriever. Pass the turn. <laughs> Swing for lethal! Uh, Frixie Metamorph, paying four. To make a copy of Iron Bully. <laughs> yep. Putting a counter on... Hmm. Spread out your damage. I think if you just spread it out and swing, you'll probably kill me. Yeah, well, I was like, do you have a... Uh, another counter? I want to call a Relic Runner, because Relic Runner can't be blocked this turn. So it's a free two that you can't block this turn. Swing at you, swing at you, swing at you. Uh, yeah, why not swing at you for the two one as well? 
Sure. Um, I will have to block. There. Just one minute and I'm going have to block that. Yep. So I'll take four. 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 Yeah. Go to three. Three. Uh, this dies, that dies, and then those, one of those two dies. I will kill off the Jorah's familiar. Fortunately, I didn't tap it away where I'd be able to Academy Ruins back so that the will, same turn. That will die, yep. um, which will trigger Return the Jorah's back to my hand. So I need to be the Eagle Construct, it's yep. more awkward. Alright. Your turn. Only one card that gets me out of oh, this. Oh, that one didn't attack soon, obviously. In a forest. I'll replay the drawers for you. Last time back. Oh. Untap. Island for the turn. Actually, no. Yes, Island for the turn. And I take two. Academy Ruins and Iron Belly. Fully back on top of my deck. I think you just swing out and die, I Yeah, I think I do. Yeah, swing out with everything because these two are one ones of menace. So you have to block both. You, you'd have to chump block. I'd have to block that way and that way. Yep. And you'd be a one. And I'll go to one. This dies, this dies. My retriever's dead, but there is no artifact because I did These that. will all trade? Yeah, uh, no. Cool. The This one's alive. It will survive. Cool. Yeah, my retriever has nothing to target, unfortunately. Alright. I need to hit Ensnaring Bridge. I. It's almost good enough. It's an Iron League Steed, which makes two creatures, but not enough to block two Menace creatures. So not enough to block two Iron Bullies! I concede. <laughs> Especially when one of them have a counter on it next yeah. time. Alright, we've we found the win. It's Academy Looping Iron Bullies. <laughs> Alright, I'm going first, since I lost that last one, so planes go. Cool. Island go. Planes you construct, it's a great one. Yep. Both of us. Alright, yes. Yeah. I'll keep them on top. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'll keep mine on top as well. Uh, island two, my own EO construct. Alright, I already knew what was there. I'm gonna keep that on top. Which makes it better for me because I've got to draw my card and then get rid of one. So there's a square one for me, but not for you. Uh, go. This refractory. Tap. Tap. I don't want to swing in that tray again. This one. And then we're here again, pay three, Iron Bully. Bring a counter on even contract, swing for free. Uh, in response, I will turn it into a 1 1. Alright, it is a. Uh, one one everything instead. Your construct is exiled. Oh, uh, your turn. Tap three. And play in snow bridge. Oh. While you are uh, tapped out of mana. Pass turn. Right. I do have four cards in hand though. Yes, but that does mean I'm kind of on the rush. Play an island. Pay. Four cards in hand, right? Four cards in hand. Two. Play no retriever. I think. And then I will swing at you one a one of mass. Uh, take one. You got any magic? Go. Yeah, one tap. Cool. You've been surprisingly okay, James. <laughs> <laughs> um, I will cycle this Ash Barons to be yeah. a forest. Because the first game was a wash, but the second game actually had Tug. Yeah. So, I'll get my forest, and then I will place it forest for the turn, and I will pass the turn. Okay. Okay. Wrong. Issue factory for the turn. I'll pay three. Play an Espazol, which is a 4 3 fly, beginning of upkeep, I return an artifact I control to my hand. How much power? How many hand? What's your hand? Uh, four at the moment. Four at the moment. 
swing at you with the one one with menace again. I uh, will take one. Cool. Your turn. Uh, end of your turn. I'm going to exile that. Uh, I have a response. Oh, yeah, I have a response. Okay, one, two, tap this. Kralik Rebuker? Yep, so I can't play through. No. So it gets your revoke existence gets countered, and I get to keep my Espasar. Tell so me, do. Right. I don't know if that was correct, though. Um, I'm gonna tap four and play an Iron Steed. Iron League Steed. And the server. Last turn. Cool. Untap? Yep. I now have three cards in hand. Yep. Upkeep, so I have to return artifact that control to its owner's hand. Gonna return Iron Bully. Not surprising. <laughs> <laughs> To draw a card for the turn. Play a swamp. Pay three. Gonna play an Iron Bully. Putting a counter on this. And here, 2 2. Gonna pay two to make and then play a Riddle Smith. Because why not? Uh, then I'm gonna swing at you with this 2 2. I will trade the 2 2. Oh. Doesn't have any return, so it goes to the graveyard. It's just there. Go. Alright, I will tap two and play an Evergreen Chalice for two. Oh, for one, sorry. And then oh, I'll tap slightly different one. And then I will tap two to play a Whisper of the Wilds. And I will pass the turn with two cards in hand. Untap. Upkeep, I need to return an artifact I control in its owner's hand. I am going to pay one from Mistress Factory, make an artifact in response, then return it to my hand. Draw for the turn. Play Mistress Factory for the turn. I'm gonna pay five. Play Scarab God. He's here, yeah. yeah. Well, I get also, once I make zombies, it gets around your incinerary route, so I drain you. I may have a read of Scarab God. Okay. How many cards in hand? Two. Two is an annoying number. Swing with the Riddle Smith, I guess? Um, I'll put the server in front. Oh, okay, try. Yep. Cool. Good turn. Good turn. Good turn. turn. Right first. Uh, tap seven for card. Response. Pay one. Tap this artifact and this artifact with Hard Review. Please nope. pay an extra three. I cannot do that. Cool. Nope. And one card in hand. Go. Nope. Untap, beginning of upkeep. This is a zombie because it's a changeling. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that. So I get to scry one and you lose a life. I do lose a life. And I'm going to. Mm -hmm. That on the bottom. I'm going to get to draw for the turn. Yeah, play an island. I'm going to pay four mana to make a 4-4 four, four Mer Retriever, I guess. And it's also a zombie in addition to its other types. And then I'm going to swing at you. What's how many cards in your hand? One. Swing at you this 1-1 one, one Menace. Uh, I can't block it, so I take one. one. I get 16. Oh, your turn. And tap. Mm -hmm. Two zombies. Oh, there's a mine. Tap four, play an Iron Link Steed, make oh. a servo again. Go. I need to find removal for Scarab God. Well, untap, upkeep. Oh, I should have returned an artifact to my hand last turn. Yeah, I think I'm pretty sure I go down the, the Mishra factory loop still, so mm -hmm. should have been okay. But this turn, pay one, make it a factory, make an artifact return to my hand. Then I get to tr resolve this, you take two, I get to scry two. I'll put this on top, this on the bottom. Then I get to draw for the turn. Then I'll play my Mishra's Factory for the turn. And I'm going to pay four to make Riddle Smith a 4 4 zombie. All of his other abilities. How many hand cards in your hand? None. Cool. Uh, then I will pass the turn. Alright, I'm top deck. I'm in top deck mode. I will play Bear Druin. I guess I will tap two. And sack it to get back one of my artifacts. And, well, we got one in there. I link Steed. Too bad Khan is not actually an artifact. Very well. 
Um, I mean, I do have more of these coming, so... Yeah. Iron League Steed, yeah. um, make, make another, another turn. Yep. Yes. We've got two of them. Pass the turn on. Alright. Untap. Upkeep. Make this an artifact. Turn it for Exposel's effect. Uh, draw for the turn. I mean, oh, I'm no, pretty sure Scout sorry. God will slowly kill yes. me if I don't find my card. Try three. <laughs> you lose three. I'm down to 11. None of these cards matter. <laughs> None, none of nothing I do here matters. It's basically like <laughs> let Scar of God do its thing and yep. wait. I'm gonna bottom all three. Draw for the turn. Play Mishra's Factory for the turn. I play a Glaze Fiend. With Riddlesmith, when I cast an artifact spell, I can draw a card. If I do, I discard a card. I'm gonna discard a Painsmith. I'm gonna pay four. Make it into a zombie. Pass, I can't actually. Do anything? Yep. I'm gonna be dead in about three turns. I play Nezus Tower and pass. Cool. Untap. Turn this into an artifact. Turn it into my hand for Espazol. Scry four. And I'll you lose four. four. Go down to seven. Bottom three. Go on top. Draw for turn. Play the Mistress Factory again. This is very silly. Um, pay three. No, pay four. Phyrexian Metamorph comes yep. in the field. It's going to make a copy of. Actually, so I get to resolve the Riddlesmith Cast Trigger first. So that yeah. might change what I do. So I'm going to resolve the Riddlesmith Cast Trigger to casting an artifact. Um, because this is a copy when it enters, it's not beforehand. So I have to declare. So I get to. I'll draw a card, then discard a card. I'm going to discard Glaze Speed. I'm going to make the Friction Metal come in as a copy of... I'm going to make it come in as a copy of one of the 4-4 zombies. I guess I'll make it come in as a copy of the Riddlesmith. Alright. Yeah, so sure. Another, another draw trigger. Yeah, it's, an, it's another... It's another draw trigger, and it's also... It's a zombie. It's copying it's a zombie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a 4-4 yeah. zombie. So that's like that's probably the best thing I can make a copy of. Right. Uh, go. Scarab God is what I'm relying on. I may be about to die, but I will assemble Tron. <laughs> you do you. <laughs> <laughs> and there's this power plant. Okay. Yeah. So, while I may not have the literal victory, I have the moral victory of assembling Tron, and I pass the turn. Okay. <laughs> Upkeep. I'm just returning Espanzoa to my hand, because I'm sick of doing this. Yep. Uh, then I resolve this. You take five. Scry five. I got a two. Uh, I'm going to bottom all of these. Not what I need. Then uh, I'm going to. So you've assembled Urzatron, which is you know one of as many inventions. But I would point out that all his inventions lead to ruin, as they play <laughs> Academy Ruins. Um, just destroying your moral victory and claiming it for myself. <laughs> I can't attack you because you have no cards in hand. Nope. As magic was meant. Um, God, I don't know. Do I? If you draw path, this game's about to go very long. <laughs> well, the only way to see is to pass it back and yeah, say If I don't pass it, I never have to deal with that. It will somehow feel less long. Oh, uh, yeah, no, I can't do anything else around it. Let's just flip it on the board. Yep. Is it path? This is game over. No, it's the path. It's not path. Sweet. You win. <laughs> well played. GG's, GG's. As the winner. Alright. All right. Now, I get to eat this, right? <laughs> yes, this is your um, dinner. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yep. Do try to listen. Yep. Yep. Listen, listen to that noise, everyone. Right. And what do you reckon? Meddling match? <laughs> Guaranteed, apparently. <laughs> Alright, uh, Ooh, it's caught, it's caught. Oh no, oh no, I got it, I got it. Okay. I won, I get to do it, even though it means I destroy the cards <laughs> in the process. You chose to make these the rules. So first of all we have... Expedition map! <laughs> well that's map. awfully fortuitous! I killed that yesterday! <laughs> oh. That's awfully fortuitous with what the game was about. Yeah, yeah. And the other one is... <gasps> Ooh. Oh, yes! Oh, there you go, Mr. Mono White Commander player. Just uh, slide the other one beside it. <laughs> well, congratulations. Holy smokes. All right, that's cool. I, the expedition map's not so bad now. Yeah, I'll take an absent.
been a very good video. Thank you for watching.